This is Molly Duker, the boxer, 2010 Shiraz from South Australia. Um, this comes to us from uh, Sarah and Sparky Marquis, um, whose winery, uh, Mo Molly Duker, produces an array of reds primarily, but they do some whites also, but an array of really bold, really intensely flavored wines um, that the critics just go nuts over. Um, you know, I, I think there's some uh, stat that says that he's got the, mo the most 94 plus wines <laughs> from Robert Parker, of any other winery. Um, so whatever that tells you, um, it, it obviously means that the wine stands out. Um, this one is 100% uh, Shiraz from three different vineyards, um, from their own vineyard in McLaren Vale, from a vineyard in uh, Langhorn Creek, and a vineyard in Panthway. So that's why it's a South Australia appellation. But they barrel ferment it, which for reds is unusual, but that's, that's what they like to do. It's barrel fermented in 60% new, 40% used American oak barrels. Um, and then the wine continues to age in those barrels. So this is um, something unique. The nose is really big. Um, you get those spices right away. You get licorice, chocolate, um, yeah, but like a cinnamon spice. Yeah, now I'm getting that, uh, so that blackberry, black cherry. Mm. Chocolate. Hmm. It's a really lively, earthy nose. Uh, let's taste. You know, <laughs> for a big, really bold wine, this wine is remarkably lush. Um, you know, it's funny, he has, he has this thing called the, the uh, Marquis Fruit Weight Scale, where he determines um, uh, uh, the quality of the wine based on how far back on your tongue you're tasting fruit before the tannins kick in. <laughs> this one is supposedly 70%. And you know what? I think he's right. <laughs> My tongue was just bathed in this really lush fruit <laughs> from this wine. Blueberry, blackberry, black cherry. Um, I'm getting those spices. On the finish, I'm still getting um, the blueberry. I'm getting a little bit of licorice, dark chocolate. Um, nice and lingering. Enjoy. <laughs>